Hey people, welcome back to another episode of Mocktail Making. Today I'm going to be um, doing an unboxing of the citrus juicer made by Lukeman. I got this from Amazon for £33 at the time, but now it's on the offer so you can pick it up for actually £23. So yeah, so anyone who's interested definitely should um, go to the link in my description. I'm going to put a link there as it's on, on offer at the moment. So definitely a bargain buy, better than what I purchased for it anyway. But yes, um, the reason why I know it's a mocktail channel, but the reason I'm doing juicer because it's one of the, the essentials you're going to definitely need for making mocktails. Definitely going to be needing juices and syrups and all that kind of stuff. So I thought I'd do a little unboxing of my juicer that I just now purchased. So without further ado, let's get it in. So I'm not going to be expecting too much. It's just the juicer, but you know, still fun to open. So. Got the glass lid thing. And put that out. And that's it. There's the juicer. Let's see, it's looking sexy at the moment. There you go. Nice little piece of cardboard came out of it. That's great. And yeah, this is the juicer. So yeah. Okay, so yes, yeah, so the juicer looks, as you can see, look quite sexy. Really small, black, sexy with the silver. And we're gonna put this in use and see how it goes. Um, yeah, so you can't really get too excited about the juicer. This is just a juicer, isn't it? Just there to juice stuff. But yeah, I definitely would recommend a juicer over a blender if you're going to start doing mocktails. Because when you're doing the blender, there's a lot of pulp involved. And it's, it's fine when you're blending um, vegetables and all that stuff. But when you're, when you're doing citrus fruits, like oranges and grapefruits, I definitely would go for the juicer over the blender i have a blender as well but yeah the juice is definitely going to be better for it i'm not going to use it now i'm going to um, clean it disinfect it and then i'm going to come back with another video on um juices versus um freshly made juices homemade juices shall i say especially homemade juices versus carton juices and if it's really worth it and that kind of stuff because as you can see i've got some oranges ready to juice here individual oranges they cost like 35p um to get like a to get these kind of oranges this cost is like um this is a four on oranges i mean tesco i got this from tesco so america you might be i don't know where you guys go to get your oranges maybe walmart or whatever but yeah tesco is, is quite expensive for fruit you might get five you might get four you don't know what you're getting but anyway um, this was like two pounds. These are like two pounds, and you can just get a carton of orange juice for two pounds as well. So, is it really worth it? We're gonna see how much you get out of these four oranges, and see if it's actually worth it, or you might have to just get a um, carton of orange juice, even though obviously it's full of preservatives and all that stuff. And you know, you get a nice feeling of making your your own oranges freshly made. So there's that too. So, yeah, but we're going to put that in the next, another video after I've cleaned it and stuff. Because we're all about cleansing this. But yeah, thank you for watching. Um, if you can, definitely subscribe and um, like my video.